Hey everyone, it's Adam with UploadWP.com and in this video I want to demo the WooCommerce Checkout Manager plugin which allows you to customize much of the checkout page without touching any code um, and in the next video I'm going to show you what the pro version of this uh, extension plugin for WooCommerce can do. Alright, so let's take a look um, at our demo site and if I go into the admin you'll see that I've already installed WooCommerce Checkout Manager and activated it. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the settings and I'm just going to give you an idea of what you can change or customize on the checkout page with literally just the click of a button without touching any, any code. So this is what the settings page looks like for the WooCommerce Checkout Manager extension and if I scroll down you'll see there's the billing section and then we have a shipping section and then there's a section to add a new custom field or to add multiple new uh, custom fields. So let's say that we want to change under billing address uh, this company name field to something else. Uh, to do that you just go into billing section and find company and then we would go to replace uh, label name. Let's just say we wanted to say business name and save changes. you'll see that it was changed to business name so it's that easy if we wanted to remove that field altogether we could do that too just by checking that box save changes and that would remove the business name or the company name field altogether from the WooCommerce checkout alright so now that's gone alright so adding a custom field to the WooCommerce checkout is super easy with this extension um, if you go down to the add new field section you can see by default they already have one there for you just to kind of show you how to do it um, and you can see that you have the option to do a text input box a uh, drop down uh, a date picker or a checkbox uh, let's say we wanted to just set this as a select options box so it's a drop down and we want to make it required so we have that box checked and if we go ahead and save changes and then go ahead and take a look at what that looks like out on the site. Scroll down. You'll see under additional information, here's our custom field, and it's a drop down. So it's that easy. You can add multiple custom fields with this extension. Uh, simply just click Add New, give it a label, a placeholder, uh, and then select the type of custom field that you want. Choose whether it's required or not. You can delete them by clicking on this checkbox right here if you needed to delete uh, custom fields. And then I didn't even touch on the shipping section. Obviously, you can also customize uh, everything over here uh, for the shipping address uh, info as well. That's all controlled right here. So there's a lot that you can do as far as customi customizing the WooCommerce checkout page with this free extension. And again, the extension is the WooCommerce Checkout Manager. As you can see, it's a popular uh, plugin. It's been downloaded over 16,000 times uh, and growing each day. So I would encourage you, if you're looking to make some basic updates to the uh, checkout page, to go ahead and install this plugin. Uh, stay tuned for the next uh, video on this, where we're going to demo the pro version of this plugin, and also check out uh, the full uh, tutorial that we have on customizing the WooCommerce checkout page out on uploadwp.com. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.